we target adults. What we need to be doing is actually starting young and um, teaching young people who, who still aren't being taught about the opportunities into the creative industry. The barrier for a lot of people is they may not fit the work culture of certain agencies and therefore that's why I feel like they're not really getting hired. So I'm from an estate in North London and I've seen the tsunami of money that washed into the area, kind of media city and tech city, but haven't washed up on my doorstep or any of the young people's doorstep around me. I also saw the amount of young talent in my area that did brilliantly at school up to 18, then dropped off a cliff because they had no network. So for me, it was about connecting those young talents with the opportunities that are available. After spending time for three days with these young people, the, the standard of talent is way beyond what I thought it was going to be. The enthusiasm, the potential, they've already got it. I'm amazed that some of them are not already in jobs. So I think for me, it's really made it crystal clear that we definitely have a really big diversity problem. Because if I can find 21 young people that are more than well equipped to be part of our industry, but can't get in, I mean, what does that say about our future? So I've been a performing artist and uh, I guess filmmaker. That's how I found out about this, this project. People um, have a tendency to stick with what they know and they get very comfortable with um, the results they've been getting and so they're afraid to, to break out and try new things and to you know, seek out even better results. So I'm a musician, I've studied music for six years, first at college and then at university. Um, from there I then went on to an apprenticeship in the charity sector with a company called Peabody Trust and it was there that I kind of discovered my um, love for kind of marketing and advertising. I think the main action point is to stop talking and start doing. So I think that if, um, if you dial into Twitter, you'll see a lot of people talking about diversity um, and, um, and words are words and action is action. Um, and I think that if we were able to skim off some of that energy in, um, in thumb strokes and bring that towards activity and action, that would make a hell of a difference. What the industry are crying out for are a, a, a range, a different range of, of students coming in, people who have different backgrounds, who have got different experiences, um, and that in actual fact um, a university degree is not um, beneficial um, at, at all uh, in certain circumstances. I just feel this course, people who are investing their time and energy into like probably investing in us, people who are in, in, on this course, is the future of what I feel advertisement means. Like forward thinking people who are willing to put their brand or their name on the line by even just allowing people in their industry just as a, like a shadowing or a taster day. So it's traditionally been, you know, people get jobs through who they know and their parents or parents' friends being in the industry. So having something um, like Brixton Finishing School where it's opened the doors to people who may not have had those opportunities has been brilliant and something we're really keen to get involved with so and just opening bit, be a bit more reflective of our communities and society as a whole rather than just having your typical people coming in through their their media degree routes. I feel like people are starting to become more self-aware and realise like um, realise that there are biases, psychological biases for example that even if they don't consciously realise why or what they're doing, that um, they're actually limiting themselves. And so I think like people as individuals and companies um, and industries are starting to become more self-aware and starting to try new things. Slowly but surely we are, we are definitely catching on. Um, there are more charities and uh, popping up and trying to push this as well as more opportunities, much like the one I'm on now, um, Brixton Finishing School. Um, so available for young people and kind of raising awareness of kind of creative job roles.